Hey Gemini, I hope you all are doing well. This is going to be a general reading for your next surprise. Any information you need, you can find it down below. I do have a March special going on right now for personals. Details are down there. I also have some other options, of course. Um, that's down there as well. So if you guys are interested, uh, like I said, it's in the description box. And what else? This can be applied to uh, your next three months, Gemini, your next surprise. So this is what we're looking at here. What do we have for Gemini next surprise? Gemini, Gemini, what do we got here? Okay, we have the uh, Three of Pentacles. Hmm. Mars and Capricorn. Somebody can have that placement here, but you don't have to, okay? Um, so that's showing up for your next surprise here. This could be a collaboration, okay? Or some attention that you didn't really expect. Could be for something you do at work. Could be a new opportunity at work. You do have the Ace of Swords right here, so some kind of communication, Gemini. What do we have here? Looks like good news surrounding work. I mean, you have the strength card here in a really powerful position, okay? Um, you have the magician, yeah, because of your skills. But a lot of you, I feel like there's something else you've manifested here. If it's a person, it might be a Leo, a Virgo, or another Gemini here. You do have the Knight of Swords, some, uh, some kind of communication for sure. Absolutely, with the Knight of Swords energy coming in so quickly. I don't know why they're coming in so quickly, though, or what this communication is about. With strength showing up, you know, that could be something that was held back. So for some of you, I honestly feel like there could be a confession. Now, typically in the Three of Pentacles, like there's like work being shown. So somebody is trying to prove something here is how this feels to me. Um, somebody's trying to prove something. For others of you, like I said, this could be something you've already proven through your work, through your skill, your craft, and you're in a really powerful position because of it, Gemini. What's this confession regarding? Seven of Swords. Deceit. Okay, something that was, yeah, I mean, it's just very straightforward here. Uh, somebody can have their moon in Aquarius, maybe moon in Leo, okay? Moon in Gemini. But the Seven of Swords is trickery, theft, deception. The Fool, risky behavior, okay? We got uh, Aquarius energy with the Fool as well. What else? What else is going on here? Somebody's laying something out for you. Like, this is a very bold confession, Gemini, if it is what I think it is. What else we got here? It's taken a lot of courage to, to do this. I know that. You have uh, the Two of Swords, Moon, and Libra. Yeah, I mean, you're going to be faced with a with a big decision. Some of you, it's going to be easy. Others of you, it's going to be very, very difficult, okay? Um, because for some of you, it's like, well, if that kind of deception went on, absolutely not. For others of you, it's like, well, you know, you're coming forward with, with this confession here. Now, for all of you, it doesn't necessarily have to be like a third party. Somebody made, you know, a, de a bad decision, a dumb decision, right? Uh, a deceptive one. For some of you, it's just simply that something was held back from you. Something was kept from you. Um, and they're explaining that to you here. They're explaining it to you. What's going on with that? What's the Seven of Swords about? King of Wands, okay. King of Wands can sometimes be player energy, all right? But for others of you, I feel like there's something that went on in the family, Gemini. It's odd energy here, but somebody could have a fire moon, a moon in Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. But, you know, with the Nine of Wands energy, somebody's uh, untrusting of you, okay, for some reason. And they're being they're being straightforward about that. They're being honest about that, Gemini. Some, some of you, there's someone in their family who knows you and has communicated something uh, to them about you. And that could be where this where this all kind of unraveled. Something Something happened here. Page of Wands, yeah, a conversation was had about you. And if this person doesn't know you, I feel like they've definitely passed some judgments anyway. And, um, yeah, somebody definitely, this person seems like they were easily influenced, all right? Maybe they didn't realize it at the time, but they're realizing it now. A lot of you, though, this, this person, um definitely had some like adventurous tendencies for sure ten of wands but this is something they carry with them like ten of wands like this is something that weighs on them pretty heavily gemini um they feel like tied to you bonded to you in some way could be a capricorn here they feel tied to you or bonded to you in, in some way shape or form yeah and they're wishing that they didn't let things go so stagnant some of you things didn't even end on necessarily end on a bad note it just kind of faded out but for others of you i feel like there was a lot of like you know, pettiness, like back and forth kind of energy here. Two of Cups. Despite there being a strong bond or a strong connection, something was kept from you. Something was kept in the dark, basically. But honestly, I feel like there is like a low-key obsession here. Maybe they're not aware of that just yet, but they're going to confess something of that nature to you. I mean, they likely won't come right out and say that, but, you know, it's something that weighs on them. And it's even those people who deal with multiple people, uh, they've become very skilled at like not developing emotional connections, but with you it's different or it's been different. 
Four of Pentacles, more Capricorn energy. Somebody could have Venus in Cancer or Venus in Capricorn. Some of you, a person, um, this person who's confessing something to you had trouble with their Pentacles due to family matters, uh, you know, due to family members, you know, draining them of their money, draining them of their resources. Like they just simply did not want to invest in this. Like something was super embarrassing to them involving their family here, Gemini. Very interesting read, very specific one. I do have personals open for anyone who may be interested, of course, Gemini. Um, and I do see some good news coming in regarding work as well. So don't think that it's all this like, you know, intense uh, you know, terrible confession, because like I said, for some of you, it's not necessarily, uh, deception that went on, but for some of you, it is, okay, um, but keep it in mind, it could go either way, of course, uh, Gemini, thank you all so much for watching and supporting me this far, I greatly appreciate you, and hopefully, I will see you next time, bye.